another new Carolina radio exclusive. I don't know, like Geico, man, you don't fuck with nobody that your homeboy don't fuck with. You know what I'm saying? Like on, like if he was dating her or some shit, you don't do no shit like that because that's fucking trifling as fuck. Okay, well, I mean, well, that's the same thing with girls. Though. Nah, you, girls don't. Girls no, little... it's different for girls because y'all out, y'all outrank us. It's like thirteen girls to one dude. So if it's thirteen y'all to one of us. Nine times out of ten, we're going to fuck one of your homegirls. I mean, if we don't know it's your homegirl, then it's different. I mean, different. well, you can't necessarily say that. What you mean? Hold on. You say you're going to do what now? If it's 13 girls to every one guy, that means if I don't fuck seven of them girls, nine times out of ten, one of them girls is going to be your homegirl. But you gonna know you know that it's my homegirl because nine times out of ten, you see us together or you've seen us together. Not necessarily. Yes, necessarily. You know how I many homegirls, females got that you never see? I don't know. That's what I'm saying. It's plenty of girls that be like, you see, like, you might not even know that's a homegirl, but then you end up smashing and it's like, oh, that was my homegirl. I didn't fucking know what the fuck is wrong with you. Yes, you, you did fucking know. The, what, the way motherfuckers be on Facebook nowadays, Man. Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram, all that shit. I be in the studio, so I don't know who fool with who or who hang out with who. All I know is all the motherfuckers gather up at the club and But nine times out of ten, shit. if you see them at the club doing nigger shit I don't be together, in the club. Well, anyway, you know... You know when two bitches are associates. You know when they're friends. So you shouldn't be fucking. She gonna th- they gonna thot and bop if they get mad at the other. No, I'm gonna go fuck that nigga just to spite her. Like niggas don't do Who no kn- shit. Who knows? I don't do no shit like niggas don't, don't do no shit, shit, like shit like that. I ain't gonna go fuck my nigga. You know what I'm saying, girl, to spite him. Like that's some stupid shit. Like me no, and him I fall out. Do no fuck me and him like fall out. Oh now, yeah, if it's I'm like a friend of a, if it's a friend of a goddamn friend, and like, I don't like that bitch. Then the, listen at you. Listen at you. Thot and bop. Thotty bop. No, no thotty bop. It's cool. You, you can't even say that. How? Because she's a friend of a friend. I don't fuck with her. If I don't fuck with her, then, I mean. Bro, if you don't fuck with her, then. If I don't fuck with her, then I can do what the fuck I want to do. Obviously, he ain't your nigga if he still, if he trying to fuck me. Man, shout out to Nestle Pure Life, man. I fuck <laughs> with that water, nigga. Y'all that shit is know. disgusting. You crazy as hell. I drank, the hell out, I drank the hell out of that water. If it ain't good for me, damn it, I, I keep drinking, keep my piss clean, so fuck I it. I might need to get me a bottle of that shit. <laughs> but back to what we were talking about, goddamn. Uh, but see, dudes, we ain't like that. Like, dudes have, like, the bros before hoes code. I mean, that's, I mean, we, I mean, we ain't got no saying for it, but, you know I mean, we the same way. Nah, not really. Most girls, they don't give a damn. They'll cut your throat quick. I don't fuck with that bitch. Bam! Fucking that nigga the next day. No. I mean, if it's your, no, I don't give a fuck. Like, I don't care. I don't give a fuck how bad me and my friend fall out. I'm not gonna go fuck her, nigga. Like, what type of shit is that? I'm talking about Who if they does broke that? up. I'm, I ain't talking about like. I don't like, give a fuck if, if they, they bro- together. Like, I don't give a fuck if they broke up. I'm not fucking that nigga. He gonna try to. He gonna try to smash if he if he thought you was attractive when they was together. Then when he when they break up, be like, yo, what's up? He and, and I'm the type of he bitch. He gonna slide them DMs. Then he gonna slide in that snap. Then he gonna drop that dick pic on you. Already know. And I'm it the is. type of bitch if y'all. If they broke up and your nigga still trying to, I'm gonna let you know, bitch. Your nigga in my motherfucking DM. Man, this nigga gonna be dropping meat mail from here to goddamn Wisconsin. I mean, ain't nothing wrong with looking at that shit, but look, look, look at you, look at you. You shouldn't even be looking at it. You need to goddamn. I mean, he's, if he sent the bitch, I mean, I got to you open the message. You shouldn't even be looking at it. You should tell that nigga stay the fuck out of my inbox, and your ass is fucking disgusting, you dirty motherfucker. I mean, of course. And go tell her. I'm, I'm gonna tell her. Of course, I'm gonna tell her. But what I'm trying to get you to understand is. <laughs> nah, bro. No, see, it, you, the way you making it seem like, oh, I'm just, you know, looking at it just to be looking at it. You got to open the fucking message. Nah, bro, it don't, it don't work like that, my nigga. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Don't work like that. If that man dropping that dick mail in your in your inbox. Me mail is, me mail is one opening. thing. Fucking a nigga is different. No, it's not. Because if you see the dick nine times out of ten, if the dick look nice, you're going to want nine that Nine times dick. out of ten, I've already seen the dick. If he sent it to my best friend, she going to be like, bitch, look at but this. But that's your best friend. I'm talking about just a friend. That's just different. A friend. I mean, well, I don't really, I can't really say, I can't relate so, because so I don't really ain't have. Now, so ain't now one of your homegirls went, went behind your back and fucked the nigga you fuck with. Nigga, my own sister is fuck niggas oh. that I fucked. Like, wow. what the fuck? Wow. <laughs> like. Wow, we don't do that shit on this side. Like, and I've, I've had a, a guy that I was dealing with who slept with one of my cousins. Who slept with your cousin, man? Put that nigga out. We ain't... not calling names. <laughs> I'm not going to call I'll his name. I'll protect the innocent on this side. I don't, you ain't going to never hear me saying nobody's name. We just going to call him Mr. A. Mr. A slept with my cousin. The situation was kind of fucked up, though. Like B, C, and D, too? What? Or just A? I said B, C, and D, too? No, just, just A. A. <laughs> but like I said... <laughs> 
<laughs> like I said, like, like I've never, me personally, I've never done no shit like that. I mean, the shit has crossed my mind. What the fuck? If it crossed your mind, you already did in the eyes of the Lord. You lusting. <laughs> but listen, like, like on some real shit, like I was dealing with a guy like last year, year for last, whatever. And uh, you know, he kind of fell off the map and resurfaced. And then one of my close friends was like, hey, you know such and such? I'm like, yeah, I know. You know, she was like, oh, he about to come through here. I'm like, bitch, you know I fucked with him. She was like, well, I think he's so sweet. He's this, he's that. Bitch. She already sucked him off, man. You too late. She probably did. She already sucked. She already <laughs> hit like, that man with the top. But I'm he like, that but you already Kevin know. Gangster. You already know that me and this individual was fucking hard. Like, not even this no no hit and run type shit. We was on like going on dates and shit. Nah, he hit her with the Kevin Gates. It was too late. He ate that ass. It was too late. She just settled for anything. So you know, if a motherfucker come by and blowing her neck the wrong way. What the fuck? She what fucking... the fuck? <laughs> hey man, I'm over here. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas come by. <laughs> Let the goddamn wind blow too hard, but she gonna drop them drawers. Fuck right. all that. Yeah, she probably ain't got nothing on. Oh god, <laughs> that's even better. These axes. You you fucking suck. You suck ass. I'm just saying that's you suck that's, donkey that's how niggas look, look at it. <laughs> Easy access. Yeah, but uh, like how many? There ain't that many guy codes we got. Like if you go out with your dogs, you know what I'm saying. We out together. You catch me talking to a chick. Don't bring your Stupid ass over there, cock blocking. I mean, that's that's girl. Co- well, no, see, it don't work like that with girls. See, girls are well. Girl- we use a wingman, so see, we I, use a wingman. So I mean, some niggas use wingman, but if I'm already engaging in conversation with the girl and you cross the damn room somewhere, you see me talk. Don't bring your stupid ass over there talking about hey, uh, bro. See, she got a whole girl, bro. See, she got a nigga. Get the fuck. I ain't even in the damn door yet. How the fuck I'm gonna get you in the door? Technically, that's not. That's not. Cock blocking. He's that trying is, to look, that's he looking out for himself. Like that's he, cock blocking. Cause he nine times out of ten, him. cause nine times out of ten, she gonna be like, "What the fuck? Why no, the fuck?" Does, he want. He like wants you your to help damn him. Child. Next code. <laughs> I'm out here, man. You already know what it is. I don't know if this applies to guys. I know it applies to girls. If you if you going out and your friend look a mess, damn it, tell them they look a mess. Like, bitch, you can't go with me looking like that. Go in the bathroom, fix yourself I mean, up. Most girls don't tell their homegirl they be looking mad. Do you not see the pictures from the club on the internet? No, bitch. I let my bitches know. You not fucking going nowhere with me looking like that. It depends on who you going out with. Well, I mean, I only go out with like a handful, like two, three people. And I let her know. I said, do you go out with, uh... Who? What you call it? Who? Twin sister. Twin, who twin sister? Twin's sister. Who's Your best friend. Twin sister. Who is my best? The twin sister. We don't really go places. I mean, you you have to be a uh, team. No kids to hang with us or team got man, a babysitter. Fuck that. Man, fuck it. I'm talking about if she go out with you, that picture you showed me on Snapchat that day, she had them got them socks on. Them stuff off. <laughs> That's different. Boy, <laughs> oh, I was she, like, when she was peeling the potatoes, bruh, she was peeling potatoes. She, put, she was peeling potatoes. But well, she like somebody scissors. got them grandma sitting right there. Boy, I like, ain't no way in hell. Next coat. Siblings are off limits. Nah, fuck that. Yeah, cause you. How? Well, you know what? I'm not. I'm gonna retract that. I can't even exactly. say exactly. I how because I, <laughs> because I just had a little you know situation going on for about a, was it a year? I didn't think it was a whole. Oh no, you. I'm trying to hear what you're talking about. You know what I'm talking about. Talking about the young guy. No, the old guy. As in your brother's best friend. Oh. I that mean, was a sibling. That was my best, well, one of my best friends' sibling. So I can't really say sibling. I, I say <laughs> siblings are off limits now. <laughs> siblings are off limits now because they are off. They are off limits now because that situation was totally fucked. How? Because me and him were de- like everybody was like, "Oh, I'm cool with it. I'm cool with. it. I'm cool with it." Because I'm so used to being around their family. But then, like, when some shit went wrong with us, everybody was giving me the fucking cold shoulder. I'm like, what that's the fuck? how it is, nigga. So you, that's why if, now if I shit say, go down between somebody that's dating, nine times out of ten, the siblings and the family, they gonna look at the person you was with like you wasn't shit. I don't give a damn. Even if, like, if something happened with me and whoever I'm dealing with, and the shit went sour, they gonna look at me like I ain't shit. They gonna be like, oh. Shouldn't have been with that motherfucker to start with. He wasn't shit to start with. Okay, but but the thing, the situation is like, we all agree when going into the situation, like whatever y'all got going on, y'all got going on. If some shit pop off, it ain't got nothing to do with us. So I'm like, okay, cool. That's the only reason why I proceeded in the situation. But see, that ain't how it go. They tell, they say that, but then when shit hit right, the when, fan, when it's when a total fan, different. When shit hit the fan, it's like 
It's a totally different situation. They fuck you. <laughs> that's pretty much. That's how it is, though. They like what, if it's you against if it's you against my siblings, my siblings are gonna tell you fuck what? you well, over me. How you gonna be mad? How I'm, you gonna be mad because they told you? <laughs> how you gonna no, be mad? They told you no, fuck no, you. No, 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 fuck you. You and her still cool, right? Me and her still. Yeah, we still we still straight, but like that now, shit don't be nothing. Like, down here. It's like awkward as shit when like we when they have like family events and I you know I'm always there. Well, and it's like when he walk in the room, it's like shit just well, go quiet. Why? Right. Fuck he Dracula or something, nigga. But it's like he walk in the room and shit go quiet, and then it, and it gets awkward because everybody immediately turns around and looks at me. What the hell they look at? Cause y'all was dealing with each other. Right. Did you know I have games break- that is good? Nah, don't do that. <laughs> it wasn't good enough, <laughs> obviously. It was awkward. It's awkward. How? We were at a kid's birthday party. Music going, kids jumping. This nigga walk in the room. Everybody turns their attention towards me. Uh, I'm like, nigga, I'm over here cutting was, cake. Like, I don't have nothing to do with How this. long ago was that before y'all stopped dealing? Like, after y'all stopped dealing? How how long was that after that? Um, I would say, like, maybe two, three months. They still was like, fuck you. I don't even, but they ain't said that shit to my fucking face. Duh, they gonna give you the stank face. They ain't gotta say it. You can see, you can feel it. That's why you was like, it felt awkward because that's the, that's the way they feel. Fuck you. I mean, the first, like, you maybe did the our first. You boy wrong. Fuck you. The, the first one or two times, yeah, that shit was awkward. But now I just be like, nigga, hey, and get, get the fuck on. I don't care. They probably be looking like, why the hell she still coming around? But you best I mean, with because I'm, right. So, I mean, like, he and he, but. You can't stop that. But you know, I make the shit, like, I don't even, I don't even make it awkward. Like, I speak and keep going. Like, he be one making googly eyes and shit. Because he want to. He won't get no more of this. That's a damn lie. He get it. Dude. I mean, if I'm in one of those vulnerable situations. See what I'm saying? What you go, why you going to lie on the air? How you going to lie? I'm not lying. How you going to lie? Gonna get it. He ain't going to get it. He ain't going to get it. We're going to get it. That's a lie. He is not. He's not going to get it. That's a lie. Anyway. Anyway. Next order of business. You got a list, don't you? Ah. Uh, let me see. Um. You got a whole damn oh, list. Oh, this there. is the most important. You must def- defend your friend's name at all times, whether they are fucking wrong or they are right. You have to. Uh, I can't. If they wrong, hell, no. I ain't defending you if you Fuck. wrong. No, if I'm too deep in the situation, I'm be Bro, like, Bro, why the I'm hell right. would I defend you Bitch, if you wrong? That's what's called fucking ride or die. No, what the fuck you mean? I don't give a damn. If you wrong, I'm not defending you if you wrong because you wrong. I don't give a damn. If you right, I'm a, I'm I'm a goddamn. I'm defending yeah. my motherfucking bitch to the end. Bro, if you right, I'm there with you 100. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck if this bitch get caught I'm with red-handed. You, I'm with you a whole hundred if you're right, but if you're wrong, if I don't, your listen, ass is just I don't show. care if this bitch get caught red-handed. I'm like, that bitch didn't, she ain't do it. Fuck that. She ain't do it. If you get caught red-handed, I'm she like, shit, nigga, I'll put some money on your books. I got you, bro. <laughs> she ain't do it. Free my dog got that jam. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Free me, man. Free my dog got the can. <laughs> Ain't no way in the hell I'm finna defend your name. You wrong. I'm defending if, it. I'm saying if y'all, like if me and my dogs out somewhere, nigga, but oh nigga, you fucked my bitch and yada, yada. Like, of course, like I'm gonna defend you, like nigga. Even if you knew he had a bitch, you still, I mean, you kinda in the wrong because you fucking another nigga bitch. But if she just threw you the pussy, that's fair, that's fair in these streets. That's, that's not fair. That's fair in these streets. Obviously, the nigga was doing something he wasn't supposed to be doing or doing or wasn't doing something he was supposed to be doing. And she stepped outside. What the fuck can you do about it? Anyway, I'm defending to the fucking wheels. You are gonna defend and get your motherfucking ass kicked from here to goddamn Wisconsin? Try me. Anyway, you gonna get your ass shot trying to defend the motherfucker that's wrong? Anyway, this one's kind of stupid because I ain't never did no shit. What fighting over guys like? Man, I don't fight over no pussy. Now that's one. That's gonna... one thing the dog stand behind. I, I tell my niggas, into... don't you ever. In your life, fight behind no motherfucking pussy, but it's too much out here to be fight behind one piece of change. Thirteen to one, anyway. Exactly. <laughs> like I said, too much. I've never got into a, like. F- have I got into a physical altercation over? You probably got on some verbal shit. Yeah, I now you know I'm. Sl- yeah, I, I'm slick with that mouth. I ain't never I've got, got into no a, verbal, some verbal shit. shit. I ain't never like bitches. Ain't never crossed me about no nigga. Ain't nobody stupid enough to fight me about no motherfucking nigga. Nah, I ain't fighting over no. I ain't fighting over no strange ass, man. That's just a dog. You now, know? You, now, me and, you know, I told you the whole situation, you know, the whole Mr. A situation with the whole cousin. Now, we got into, like, a little, you know, verbal, you know, she called me a few bitches, but she ain't never really. Bitch! <laughs> <laughs> That's just about it. Like, she's never, like, she physi- the rap she's ad-lib. never physically crossed me because she know I will, I will beat her ass. She hit you with the rap ad lib. Bitch! <laughs> 
saying she probably said it hard too. She probably, she probably did. Felt that. You, but the I thing felt is, that she, she said she's it. never really said. But that's the thing. Like she's never really said that shit to my face. Who like, the hell she said it to then? There's been situations where we've been in the same room and she'll make like super, like stupid little comments and shit. But she never really said the shit to me. Oh, she's saying it to you. She, no, that you, bitch ain't saying you, you ain't saying it. shit to me you unless you come to my motherfucking face and see. You know that verbal subtweet was to you. Anyway. You knew it was directed towards you. Y'all never. in the same room. You felt the energy. <laughs> I know I ain't feel a damn thing. She called you a bitch. She can call me a bitch, but that's all she can do is call me a bitch. Too short your ass. Bitch. <laughs> she ready to whoop your motherfucking ass in over that nigga. Now, I, I can't do it, bro. I could never see myself fighting over I could no not piece fight of over, vagina. No, I could not fight over no nigga. And even if you my wife, I'm not fighting. I'll fight for you, but I'm not finna fight over you. First of all, if it's your wife, you she shouldn't be fucking with nobody else and do what you I know, but I'm just saying if, anyway. if it's, I'm just saying if it's some shit that go down and you know what I mean. Anyway. She in the wrong, goddamn it. Mm. I'm anyway, right. anyway, <laughs> exes are off limits. We already talked. About, we did talk exes. About this. Yeah, like nigga, my ex is off limits. You cannot fuck How? with him. That's free game. That is not that boy. A free man in back that in the street. Fucking not. You cannot that fuck boy, my ex. How? How? That's what I'm saying. How can a how can you tell a female, oh no, you can't fuck my ex? If y'all you are my not, friend, you cannot fuck my ex. Y'all are not together anymore. That I don't means give he's a fuck free. if we're together he or like, not. You cannot that fuck boy my like ex. He fresh out the pen. That boy finna hit everything come his way. Uh, and that bitch gonna get hit too. With exes what? are off limits. That's like t- hey, anybody fuck, that I've listen, exes are off limits. Anybody that I've talked will talk to like real heavy, like people I fucked. You cannot you cannot do that. How are you going to tell somebody else what to do with their damn penis and vagina? First of all. You can't tell nobody. Because it's the fucking girl code. Ain't no damn, man. Yes, it is. <laughs> you can't do it. It's 2018. Most of them goddamn codes don't even apply no more because people don't give a right. fuck. Right. Motherfuckers just don't care nowadays. They trifling. Right. Motherfucker going to fuck your grandma if they had the goddamn chance to. You know oh, what I mean? Oh, shit. Trifling. That's fucked. I'm just now, Just thinking about <laughs> like, just like yeah, motherfuckers don't care nowadays. Like, See? God Sweet damn, dog. like the we whole, what's the, what's, the, what's the fucking, the Kardashian brother boy, his girlfriend, baby Rob, mama, what's her name? Black, Black China? China? Yeah, the whole Black China. Damn, they all fucked up over there. The whole goddamn family. <laughs> they are all fucked Free up. Free my nigga Kanye, man. Free my boy Kanye at the jam. They got him in the jam <laughs> over there. Kanye. They were all fucked his up. His name man. is Kanye Kardashian now. That boy need to get the hell out of here. He need to get out. Need to put the cup, the teacup down. Somebody need to take his goddamn picture. Do something. I mean, they take his picture. That shit don't work. Turn the flash up. Stadium light in his goddamn face for him to get up out of that. Poor Kanye. Then Kim Kardashian said she cooked that crispy cornbread. <laughs> Whole goddamn cornbread tastes like the corner. Crispy cornbread? Whole fuck? damn. She probably put corn in the cornbread. Whole damn cornbread tastes like the corner piece, man. Nobody want that shit. Who the fuck makes cornbread like that? Man, we done got all the way up top, but I don't give a fuck. That's that shit your fault. Funny. You don't that shit funny, man. I don't give a crispy damn. When I seen bread. that shit, I cried laughing. Oh, my God. Crispy corn. What the fuck? I've never heard of it. But they go back to the fucking exes thing. Them celebrity motherfuckers don't care. Because them niggas got money. They can do that. When you a basic ass motherfucker, fuck? you What's can't be difference? doing. What's the difference? Money or not, Ugh. you still a money or no money. You still a regular them motherfucker. Them motherfuckers ain't got no morals, no values. They don't fucking care. Exactly. So how you gonna expect the motherfucker who ain't got shit to give? You should fucking get. Like I said, I can't none of my I bitches. I be in my. I only I got like. World. I only got like four or five bitches that I really fuck with. So you just gonna call them bitches? Cause they my bitches. It's not like I'm calling them bitches, but they my bitches. You feel me? <laughs> you just. <what> the fuck? <laughs> that's like calling people niggas. Like that's you my nigga. Anyway, like I said, none of. But my bitches, like we don't. We're not even. I can't say we're not interested in the same kind of guys, but I be dealing with some old, we already know. I'm not even going into that. Coons. Some who? Coons. <laughs> They're not coons. Some motherfucking coons. No, but I don't, I don't think, I can't, well, I don't think they would be interested in somebody that I've been dealing with anyway, so. How I you know? To, you don't know what people be, man, My bro, friends anyway? Well, I can't even recall them friends because me. it's just the, the people that you I hang with are my cousins. really like, don't know what people be interested in. It be some crazy shit behind closed doors shit that you don't know like you'll be like you'll be like oh she wouldn't talk to him cause you know that ain't her type little do you know she all in his DM right hey big head I got some shit that was brought to my attention like a couple past couple weeks 
I'm Talk like, to what me. the fuck? You know who me? does that? Park the car and walk with me. <laughs> Can't tell you that. Can't tell you that. People gonna be listening to this. <laughs> but I'm just saying, like that's. I don't, don't want to hurt anybody's feelings, you know. Man, fuck people feelings. Know, people don't right? give a damn about your. Obviously, they don't care about your feelings if they did it. I mean, well, this this situation really has nothing to do with me, but it's just like, who the fuck does that? Like, uh, people because they trifling as fuck. I know. I right, see. That's why I, I two people, well, three people at the most that I really deal with. I don't deal with. I don't think I deal with that many damn people. Whatever. See, see, this is perfect example. What? You don't let your friends look like any fucking thing. Cause the titties, man. What the fuck you mean? Bro, her titties are not even in that fucking thing. That's good. They need to come on Listen, out. First Somebody all, should just walk fu- up and hit it. And... This is your fucking wedding day. You should not be looking yeah, this way. Well, you out there, you you out there that is with disgusting. the titties out on your that wedding day. Your husband getting to see this thing the is merchandise. Barely, this thing is barely covering her nipple. Like I said, her husband is getting to see the merchandise before he I'm buy it. Sure. If he proposed to her, he already got that merchandise. But he get to see the merchandise on a wedding day. Because you know you're supposed, see, ain't, you're supposed to see your bride on the wedding days. Who? You're supposed to see your bride on her on the wedding days. No, you're not. Exactly. So he got to see uh, straight merchandise in your face. That is just disgusting. Suck the nipple right in, right in front of everybody. Like a damn baby. So, so if your girlfriend, man, you out your damn mind. Your be, I crack a whole damn damn skull open right there in front of her family. So, so it's okay for this lady to look like this at her wedding, but your girlfriend can't. Hey man, that's on the internet. Think I should do it? But me. eventually, I mean, it's somebody's. That's the somebody's internet. Somebody's wife. Somebody. That's cousin. them. That's on the internet. That's and then them. there's, and then it's, it's bad because there's the bitch standing right behind her. Like you could have just. Because a homegirl didn't give a fuck about her life. Right. Maybe that, I don't know. That just that didn't sit too well with me. A homegirl didn't give a damn about her life. She and it said, just looked Fuck like it. the dress was too little. Like it probably was. You know how man, you know how these women is nowadays. They on some damn I gotta have the smallest waist and the fattest ass and a big man. Nobody care about no shit like that. Ain't shit small over here. Man, ain't nobody ask about you. Who me? Ain't nobody come for you. <laughs> ain't nobody walk down the street to grab your ass, come back up here and talk. Mm. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> All right, we out of here. Another one. I'm from Rock Hill. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck does that have to do with the price of tea in China? Oh shit! I'm from Rock Hill, nigga. I wouldn't tell nobody this shit. I don't have to. They already know when I step in the building. But where you from? You must be from South Carolina, cause you country's here. Why do a lot of people say that? And you slinging that pipe. Oh God! <laughs> you said it, not me. Friendly ass, I'm slinging friendly. that pipe. I'm not friendly with a damn. I don't slang that pipe. You can catch shit out here in these streets, y'all. Protect yourself. Wrap it up. You know what I mean? Right. Buy the Trojans, uh, whatever you got. Just don't do it. Well, I bought a, I bought a thirty six pack. God damn! I bought a thirty six. And you use uh, all thirty six of them bitches in a week? No, nah, I don't use them in a week. I'm telling about. I'm gonna tell you why. I went to uh, Walmart, the Walmart Marketplace the other day. Oh God! I mean, it was like last week, two weeks what ago, two weeks ago. My sister works there. Two weeks ago, she wasn't there. She so I'm in there, there, right? I'm in there. I'm I'm, I'm, I'm walking through the store because I'm like, damn, what the hell the condoms at? So I finally found like the associate manager, assistant manager, who the fuck this nigga was. Shout out to that guy. <laughs> but um, but walked over there. I said, hey, bro, uh, where y'all condoms at? Or did I say where y'all rubbers at? I think I said where y'all rubbers at because he's black. So I knew he knew what I was talking about. <laughs> so, so white guys don't know. Cool. So I goes over there. I see. I'm looking at things. I'm trying to find the ones I want. So I find them, grab them. I'm get. I'm reaching down to pick them up. Some old white lady behind me because like the way they pharmacy made is like a bench in the middle. Yeah. Where, so I'm over there bending over pick the shit. I grab them. I look up and turn around. She looking all in my face. Like I'm like, bitch, you ain't never seen nobody buy condoms. You don't protect, you don't, y'all don't wrap it up? Y'all don't believe in wrapping it up on your side of town? Hell no, they don't. So I walks over they there. I'll dog everything. So, <laughs> so I walks over there to goddamn pay for them. This is, it's a light skinned girl standing in the aisle beside me. And it's another woman on the other, on the other aisle beside me on the other checkout thing. So I'm standing up with the condoms holding them in my hand. You holding them where everybody can see them? Why the fuck not? <laughs> you gotta be proud when you buy stuff like that, man. So people know. I wrapped this dick up because you don't want to get and the you hiccups. The magnums, didn't you? Of course. Why, why not? I'm not slinging no goddamn lifestyle meat. 
Got no fucking Durex pipe over here. What the fuck I look like? What the fuck? Lambskin. Not the lambskin. This is not going to make you itch. Lambskin. I wouldn't want that. Another one. That wasn't that long. You got to get off that crack rock. It's not a you crack. You better remember it's shit. Not a crack. Get off the rock. 2018. We, it's 2018, babe. We getting off the rock. Uh, we sure are, cause I ain't on a damn rock. No rocks, no crystal meth, no none of that shit. You on the hair on that base? Oh, I don't do no damn that hair. Hard. Life. That's that's that real hard, boy. No. no. That take your teeth out. No. No crystal meth take your teeth out. The hair wouldn't do it too. I wouldn't know, nigga. I got my teeth. Nigga, I dare to be different. <laughs> I am different. That's why I smoke weed. I dare to be different.